Welcome to day one of body weight to body building. I am super, super excited for this series. We have Katrina over here. Look at her. Hey. Say what's up. We have Alexa behind the camera. Say what's up. <laughs> so basically what we're gonna be doing today is in during this series, I'm going to vlog probably once per week, maybe not, depending, but what I really want to show you is, what's so funny? What's so funny? Maybe I'll vlog, maybe not. <laughs> no, but what I am going to be doing is really documenting me going from body weight to more bodybuilding movements. I will still add in a few different functional movements just to make sure maybe a circuit at the end or whatever, however I would like to. But what I really, really want to do is show you my progression through doing all these movements, these machines, things that I've never done before. I'm going to follow workouts from other people and really document the experience. So we'll be posting probably around four days per week. I am going to keep up with this series. I promise you on that. Today we have Alexa helping me. So you're going to see me going through everything and I'm going to talk through everything. So subscribe if you haven't already and let's fucking go. You can join me on the journey if you want. You can join me on the workouts. I'm going to be posting specific days. You'll see upper body, lower body, upper body, lower body, or however I want to do it. So uh, let's jump right in. All right, so what are we gonna do today? So we're gonna warm up our laps first. So we're gonna do cable lap pullovers. So we're gonna do about two sets of 30, just to really- Two sets of 30? Yeah, just to warm up our laps. Freaking bodybuilding movements. This shit's brutal. Ugh. See the pain. 29. 30. 30. All right, so warm up is complete. What we're gonna be doing now is lap pull downs in a neutral grip, moving to a wide grip row, seated row. You ready? Let's get it. Alright guys, so what we're gonna be doing is jumping in from Regular presses here to a more incline movement, push movement, a little bit of functionality added in. 10 warm ups, two warm up reps, shoulder press dumbbell. Again, I never do this movement either. I usually do one arm standing, functional. I add functionality to it, but a minute to win it. Body weight, it's a bodybuilding. Crazy. Ooh. Feeling it, feeling good. So I'm on my third set. This super set. My arms, I'm literally dead. Like what in the I have so much respect for bodybuilders. It's just fucking crazy. So what we have is 10 isolation rows right here. Neutral grip, a little bit closer to the body. Then we're moving to some incline presses, some bench press. Now she's doing a machine. I wanna again, incorporate a little bit more functionality with it, so a little bit more free weight. So I'm gonna be doing it on the regular bench. Um, I'm burnt right now, I'm destroyed, but here we go. So what we're gonna be doing is a row to a full flexion of that shoulder joint. Sorry for next door, it's like super loud, but full flexion of that shoulder joint with the barbell. And then we're gonna go straight from there into a tricep extension. Then we're gonna come right back down and that's gonna be one repetition. 
I want to aim anywhere from six to ten, and this is how we're going to burn out using more functionality. So this is more functionality going from movement to movement to movement, and then in different workouts, I'll incorporate a little bit more body weight training for my functional endings of my training, so I don't get completely stiff and overworked by the bodybuilding movements that I'm doing. And, and I, obviously, I don't want that. So here we go. So row here, hinge all the way up, and then tricep extension and back down. Most important thing is keeping a neutral spine the whole time. You don't want to rock. Keeping those elbows as tight in as possible. Right back down. Second you feel like you're fatigued, when you really want to stop. So there you have it guys. You can do a couple sets of that. You saw all the movements you're able to incorporate into your own exercise in your workout. So this is what body weight to bodybuilding is gonna look like. You're gonna see the training, you're gonna be able to follow the training, and also tune into the podcast for extra motivation and stuff. Remember, link is in the description. So appreciate you guys tuning in for this episode of body weight to bodybuilding. Unique stuff. I'm gonna be training with new people all the time. Sorry for the loud ass noises again. Subscribe now if you haven't already. Comment down below if you like this stuff, if you'd love to keep on following it. It's really cool incorporating different types of movements into my training and really building some size. So thanks for tuning in once again, and I'll see you next time. Peace.